Some serious power problems for a mobile home park in Norfolk. Not only are some people living there without power, but 10 on your side also found two power poles down at the Central Park Mobile Home Park. So what's the story here? 10 on your side's Andy Fox has this new tonight. Some residents here at Central Park Mobile Home Park in a real tough bind. This is Taylor. How do you describe this? Uh, honestly, unacceptable. The pole's been leaning for months, and now two mobile homes have no power, and it could be two weeks before the pole is reset. You reported that five months ago. Yes. Nothing's done about it. Nope. What do you think about that? No. <laughs> what I think is, I mean, it's, 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 not, it's not right. Juan got a generator, but Taylor got on the phone to property management to find out where his is. I will not be using the money out of my pocket to supply the power to your generator for an issue that your company caused. We wanted answers too. I was wondering if we can find out what's going on. Hello? Hello? She hung up. At 2 p.m., we found property manager Marcus Richardson on site. Can you just tell me what you're going to do for these people? For now, we're, like I said, we're getting the generators hooked up so that they do have power. Uh, they can get everything running until the electric company does come out and finish the work that they've been contracted to do. Down the street, we found this mobile home uninhabitable due to no power. Yesley Maldonado speaks little English, but says she's been living in a motel. They start seeing loose and they start seeing casa. And she said uh, uh, she, she really feels so bad and sad because they already been three weeks without, you know, out of the, his trailer. We've been out to Central Park Mobile Homes before. Years of issues out here. It's owned by YPB LLC. In 2010, there were guilty pleas to misdemeanors for unsafe and unsanitary conditions. How does it get to this position? Uh, at this point, to be honest with you, I've been told not to speak to the news. Um, so I'm going to have to stop there. It's not the first time that Central Mobile Home Park has been in the news, and we are told that city inspectors will be out here again Monday at 1130, and 10 on your side will be here too. In Norfolk, Andy Fox, 10 on your side.